Okay, well in, in this part of the video I'm going to go through the uh, photographs that I shortlisted to uh, do a painting of or to use as a basis for the painting. So I shortlisted it to, to a handful of photographs and I got them printed. I went into Sudbury today and got them printed rather than print them myself because I haven't got any ink for the printer. So it was only three pounds to get them printed, so I think that's a bit um, cheaper than printing it at home. So this is my selection of photographs. So if I put them down here, and I'll put them on the screen as well. Um, first of all, this one, which was basically the uh, a field of, um, I just love the, the color of the little flowers. Um, in the field, and uh, yeah, I really oh, I've got my finger over the microphone. So this was my choice number one. I just liked the photograph, but I didn't think I don't know. I don't know whether it can be enhanced in any way by a um, by a painting. So choice number two was. Um, this one, which is of the of the camera looking up, I love the shots like this. The camera looking up the the, uh, the towards the tree. It's like a big a big monster with its big arms out, ready to grasp you. I quite like that photograph. This is another version of it, but um, I sort of softened the leaves a bit. Uh, in the software and um, but the trunk itself is darker so that, that was my the next choice was this one uh, which was actually taken with a 600 Canon 600D and this was actually sunrise so this was literally first thing in the morning and I love this photograph but I don't think a, it's a bit a little bit dark anyway but I can I can fix that but I think it would work better just as a photograph as it is I don't think it can be It'll a painting it will in any way enhance it. Uh, the next one was the the uh, wheat is that wheat or barley? I think it's wheat, isn't it? Uh, field with the the cottage in the back. And I cheated on this photograph because actually that's not the sky that was there. It was blue sky, but actually there's a big electricity pylon and cables and whatnot going through the skyline. So as you can see from the original photograph. I completely uh, erased them and put a nice blue sky. But, and again, that, that that works fine as a photograph, it's a small photograph. I can see that being a little frame hanging somewhere on the wall. I like this one as well. I like the just the variety of wild um, flowers and the and the colours really work well together. I did over. Um, I did bring up the saturation of the colours a little bit and play around with the contrast just to make it stand out. But again, I think it probably works fine as a, as a photograph rather than, than uh, a painting. So that leaves one, and this is the one I have chosen to do a painting of, which is this one. Now again, it was... Um, it was just I just loved the way that this property was just hidden from view. You'd literally pass this gate, and there was this beautiful little garden. And what you can't see in the photograph is actually the uh, the other part of the house behind that is all thatch. And this is the the tile bit that you can see here is is quite a, a new extension. And I think I'm going to do a painting of this and just put a bit more colour in it. I'm going to remove the tiles. And put a thatch roof on it and I think that'll make a nice little painting and it wasn't a terribly good photograph by this time the Sun was quite harsh and produced some really um, strong highlights and it sort of um, bleaches out a wee bit in the photograph and it was hard I mean I did another variation of it here just to bring up the the uh, contrast and some of the detail in it but I think this is the one I'm going to do a little painting off and so that's my my task my next task is the painting so that comes next but this this is my this is my choice I think it'll be a nice little painting it'll only be a small painting
So that's my the next project now is to get on with the painting. So I sort of spent uh, the day getting the photographs done, editing the first uh, part of the video, the walk, which I did yesterday. And now it's the painting. So I'm going to start that tomorrow and see how I get on with that. It might take most of the day. It might take a couple of days. But um, that's my intention to start that tomorrow. So it'll be interesting. I'm looking forward to seeing what comes out of that. And uh, I'll see what you think. Okay, see you soon.